Leaves aren't the only plant organs that photosynthesize. Today, we're talking about photosynthetic bark. Let's botanize. This is striped maple, Acer pennsylvanicum, and you can see that the bark is very dark green. If we scratch away at it a little bit, you can see that that color becomes much more vibrant. This green reveals the presence of chlorophyll, which is the light harvesting pigment in the process of photosynthesis. It's the same pigment that gives leaves their dark green hue. To do photosynthesis, a plant needs to harvest sunlight. Leaves provide a lot of surface area for plants to do that. However, some species have evolved strategies to photosynthesize along the entire surface of their bodies. Photosynthetic bark is common in species that hang out in the understory, like shrubs and small treelets like this Acer pennsylvanicum here, and is also associated with species that tend to have thin bark. Having photosynthetic bark allows understory trees and shrubs to take advantage of excess light when canopy trees have dropped their leaves in the fall or before they've leafed out in the spring.